go on a visit with them. I understand, uh, is this Connor right here? This is Connor. This is Connor. Connor, nice to see you. Thanks for coming in. <laughs> and uh, introduce yourselves, please. I'm Dave Bell. Okay. I'm Connor's father. Okay. And I'm his mother, Bonnie Bell. Okay, well, thanks so much for coming in. We've Thank got you. a big, beautiful event coming up uh, this week for Make a Wish. Yep, we have the the Big Wish Gala coming up on mm -hmm. the 7th of February. Uh, Don't you mean Gala? Gala. <laughs> there you go. Way to go, Connor. <laughs> and that is um, uh, one of our big fundraisers for the Make-A-Wish Foundation. Right. I attended last year and heard so many special stories, and yours is uh, one that we'd like to share this morning. Go ahead, Bonnie. Well, back in um, 2009, mm -hmm. uh, Connor uh, developed a a limp that was just unexplainable and mm -hmm. it turned out that he had a, a tumor on his uh, above his left knee okay. and uh, it was determined that he had osteosarcoma which is a bone cancer and um, we basically what happened is we called his pediatrician they called him some x-rays and next thing you know I'm getting a call at work saying Toledo Children's Hospital oncologist is waiting you need to get up there right now so we went up your there your heart and must have just gone up into your throat it was horrible. It right. was horrible. And um, so we went up there and um, we wind up getting referred to um, Ohio State University, Dr. Joe Mayerson there, mm -hmm. to do an official diagnosis. They had to do a bi bone biopsy, which they did, and in fact it came back as positive for osteosarcoma. And, um, and then we were told that we had six weeks to make a decision of how to get rid of the, uh, the bone tumor after he completed 12 weeks of chemo, very aggressive chemo. And um, so Connor had to go through, um, we, he had to have his leg amputated, his left leg was amputated. It was a special amputation, it's called rotation plasty. And basically what they did is they removed the middle portion of his leg from his, uh, above his knee to a little bit below the knee. They turned the bottom of his leg, his, uh, his femur and his foot 180 degrees, reattached it. So his uh, ankle um, is now a, operates the same way that your knee would. So wow. he steps into a prosthesis. And um, Connor's doing great. He's, uh, after completing chemo, he has uh, been declared NED. And uh, we just uh, celebrated two years in um, September NED and no evidence of disease. And um, we're about to go on uh, sn snowboarding uh, right. next weekend. He went last year, and but he's running, jumping, he's uh, ice skating. That's fantastic. Yeah, You're a champion he's doing inspiration, great. Connor. He's doing great. <laughs> we just went so, skiing this past weekend. I hope you have half the fun we did la uh, this coming weekend with your trip. And snowboarding is the best. <laughs> it is, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Nothing like yeah. it. Well, you guys must have felt like you were on, on, on an island when this when this hit, but Make-A-Wish uh, helped you through it? Yes, you know, um, for us, um, our, we, we were fortunate to be able to go on the Make-A-Wish trip and enjoy it because Connor was done with treatment. He had just gotten his um, <laughs> his prosthetic leg and uh, so when we went um, he was feeling really good and for us it was to celebrate um, and be thankful for the blessing that he was cancer free mm -hmm. and um, so it was it was really a wonderful time and, and we know families that you know uh, get to go on make-a-wish trips right. to celebrate like us but unfortunately there's also families that go because they're making memories to last lifetime right. because the prognosis isn't good mm -hmm. and um, we know a lot of families that wouldn't be able to go on a trip and have those times because of the medical bills that rack up Absolutely. Um, you know um, and, and so it's it's something that gives them inspiration and hope and um, and good times away from the hospital atmosphere thanks so much for sharing uh, your your uh adventure and your uh, story with us. Uh, the event is Thursday night. Uh, please, if you can, uh, pitch in, go to the event. It is fantastic. And uh, well, all the information uh, can be found at our website, northwestohio.com. Nice meeting you all. And Connor, Thank have you. a Thank great you for having time. Us. Thank you to Make-A-Wish. Uh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. absolutely. Okay. Yeah.